all right hello YouTube once again it's Tech Chan and I'll be discussing about Digico SD9 using a recall times so this one recall times how to use recall times in Digico so that means you will set one timer from one snapshot and then automatically it will jump to the next snapshot so this is just a very short video on uh, a very fast and very quick video tutorial on how to use recall times in digital so here's what we're going to do you need to go to you need to press this option recall times okay and then you will pop up to this window see okay let me um, uncheck this first okay because in default by default it's actually um, unchecked so all you have to do is to check activity yeah here also the next snapshot check on other side okay check everything and then you can see there it says duration okay that's the most important part okay the duration so for now it's actually set for 10 seconds for the sake of um, video uh, tutorial so that means um, see here it's 10 seconds if you go down here here is the settings where you can set the R minutes seconds and frames okay so actually I set it for 10 seconds for the sake of video tutorial so so that you will not wait for a long time before um, this snapshot jumps to uh, jumps to the second snapshot okay so i will change it here so previously it's 10 seconds but uh i will make it um 20 seconds uh, for this video okay highlight or um touch seconds and then use this one rotate to change the value okay so here touch turn okay this, um, this is where you uh, do the dial to change the value um for your settings it's up to you whether you put uh, minutes or hours it depends um to you or how long you want your snapshot to um, to jump to that snapshot so by the way i use this um uh, settings because um here so that not uh, all the time you come uh, we we open the bgm or the background music for this outlet so after a certain time it should shut down or turn off the background music so instead of coming back and forth i set it here um in recall times so that means this first snapshot um the pc playback here on my board uh let's check if you can see okay let's say this is my um bgm or background music running for um today so in this first snapshot it should be open all right it should be unmuted so let's say for example there is a music playing for now okay here and then i will set it for let's say 20 seconds after 20 seconds it should uh jump to the next snapshot which is programmed to be muted okay so this strip the playback from the next snapshot it should be muted so once after let's say 20 seconds when when the time is done when it jumped to the second view of course it's it's uh it's muted so uh i'll make it 20 okay 20 seconds all right that's it so it should be here i'll click here first from the duration okay duration uh, there you go it should be 20 seconds okay it should be 20 seconds okay look up there duration is already 20 as well okay um, uh, there you go it's 20 also so let's close this one all right and then let's fire up the first snapshot see you can see a running purple uh, counting for 20 seconds all right let's check from the fader all 
all right so it did not um change because the settings from the previous snapshot is uh, the same so what i'm going to do is i will edit or update this um, snapshot so but here you can see it jumps to the second snapshot so what i'm going to do is i will update the second snapshot first this should be muted all right i'll press mute and then uh, so that you can see I'll bring down this fader and then I will press update Okay, it should be update current from here, right? That means it's updated that it's muted and it's closed. So let's try again. All right Okay, I'll fire again the first snapshot All right, there you go. My faders move. That means I change already snapshot. Okay, so so much for now. I think we're done for this episode for this tutorial with the Digico SD9. So much to say about this um Digico because so many features with this um um beast console. So for the sake of this episode, I'll stop for this video and soon I'll be making more videos that is related to Digico SD9, alright? Once again, it's your Tech Guide Chan. Practice and make sure you do it yourself for you to be able to learn, alright? So for me to make new, uh, new and more videos related to uh, technology, well, all you have to do is to press subscribe down there all right once again press and subscribe for more videos to come once again i'm your tech guide for today my name is chan ciao for now bye